biomechanics is about how the body moves. Coaches use biomechanics to analyze athlete movement, to improve technique and reduce injury risk. Five important components of biomechanics are motion, force, momentum, levers and balance. Motion is the movement of the body or an object through space. Speed and acceleration are important parts of motion. In the javelin throw, I need to analyse the speed of the athlete as well as the angle and height of release. Force is a push or pull that causes a person or an object to speed up, slow down, stop or change direction. When optimal force is required, an athlete needs to move their body parts sequentially. For a striker to hit the ball hard and fast, I look at timing, speed and angle of the swing and the point at which they hit the ball. Momentum is a combination of weight and speed. There are two types of momentum, linear, which is about movement in a straight line, and angular or rotation momentum. For a tumbling sequence, I need to understand linear momentum for the approach and to ensure a stable landing. I also need to understand angular momentum to ensure the skill can be completed. Without enough angular momentum, the athlete would under-rotate and miss their landing. Our arms and legs act as levers, as does any equipment that extends length, such as brackets, bats or paddles. There are three parts to a lever, the resistance arm, the force arm and the axis of rotation. In rowing, the resistance arm is the outboard part of the oar. The force arm is the inboard part of the oar and the axis of rotation is the pin. The levers can either be used to increase speed or force. In rowing, the oar is a speed lever, as the outboard part of the oar is longer than the inboard part of the oar. The longer the outboard, the faster the boat can go. However, the longer the lever, the more force required by the athletes. Balance is about being stable. An important principle of balance is the alignment of the centre of gravity over the base of support. Balance is influenced by the width of the base of support, the height and motion of the centre of gravity and the weight of the person. Having good balance is important for the many skills of basketball, such as setting screens, playing defence, changing direction and shooting the ball. By gaining a better knowledge of the components of biomechanics, coaches can better analyse their athletes and use that information to improve performance. Ask yourself these questions. How do these components apply in your sport? Motion, force, momentum, levers and balance. How can you gather and use information about these biomechanical components to improve your athletes?